Good morning, everybody. It's Andrew Smith from Morella Page, Kelowna. Welcome to Coffee with Andy. It's Tuesday, March 5th, 2024. We're at Starbucks again. Um, Starbucks Canadian Tire behind me. Um, um, let's call it Staples parking lot behind Kira there, right in the corner of uh, Lecky and the highway. It's probably our favorite Starbucks. You know, Starbucks is aren't our favorite place to come to just because it's a big chain, it's American, blah, 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 blah. We prefer small, local, you know, kind of places that no one's been to. Maybe there's maybe there's um, fewer tourists, more locals. But nevertheless, this is where we come when we're, when we're in a hurry and it's close and we just don't have a lot of time to plan it. But nevertheless, here we are at Starbucks. Nice, this is, I would say, the nicest Starbucks out of the dozen or so Starbucks in town. Yeah. So let's get to it. Um, so let's wrap up the month, for the, the month ending February 29th. There were 121 residential sales for the month of February compared to 103 January. So we've gone from 103 to 121. I guess, I don't know what that's, you know, just under a 20% increase, which seems like a lot, but my goodness, 100, 120 sales. It's good that it's going in the right direction, but really those numbers should be 203 and, and 221. Um, you know, these numbers are what you would typically see, I guess, in places like Merritt or, or Rubblestoke, certainly not Kelowna. I don't care what type of season it is, but they're going in the right direction. So that's good. Um, here to date, 2024 compared to 2023, uh, 225 sales compared to 212. So that's going in the right direction. That should be 425 compared to 412, but still going the right way. Average sale price was $1,021,000 this year compared to $1,074,000. So these numbers are almost all, they're in the same neighborhood, right? Um, difference between a million and 70 and a million and 20 is really a couple of high-end sales. And, you know, we're behind where we were last year and 120 versus 103. 225 versus 212 that's uh, a conveyancer at a medium sized real estate office was sick on the last day of the month and didn't get paperwork handed in on time until the following Monday that's that's the difference so it's kind of it's kind of similar um, you know this year compared compared to 2023 but it is edging up um, looking at apartment sales um, you know it's increasing also from 57 in January up to 64 in February. Again, it's not 157 up to 164, but still, right direction. And there are exactly 600 uh, apartments apartments for sale in Kelowna right now. That numbers, all of these numbers are gonna go up as, uh, as the year goes on, but that's where we are right now at the end of uh, February, beginning of March, 2024. One of, uh, one of the sales last week for the apartments was uh, one of Kara's. Kara put a really good deal together on a place up near, up near the university. Um, sold in a reasonably short period of time, well priced, sharply priced, professionally marketed, offer negotiated, done, firmed up. Way to go, Kara. Um, the average sale price uh, for an apartment in Kelowna right now, uh, well, the first two months, was $491,000 versus $445,000 for first two months of last year. That's my market report. Hey, thanks for coming. Props to you guys, anyone who took notes, anyone has questions, give me a call or send me an email or a text or whatever, uh, however you'd like to communicate with me. Thanks for watching, talk to you next week.